Alright, hey everybody, this is Jeff, aka Slinger, and of course I've got my good friend here, Case1320. How you doing, Case? Hey, what's up, everyone? Alright, I'm not going to take a vape when I'm supposed to talk this time. And, um, uh, okay, what's on, the, what's on the plate for today, buddy? Today we will be doing a dual juice review for evaporclouds.com. This is their Papa Smurf. Cool. Um, I have Papa Smurf 10 mils right here. Uh, mine is 24 milligrams, just so you know, of uh, nicotine strength. Right. And um, mine is a 50-50 blend, propylene glycol. I love it when I can say that. And vegetable glycerin. And mine is uh, 16 milligrams, and I will just say PG and VG because, yeah. All right, well, I've just been hitting it at five volts, and the vapor production is good. The throat hit is there. I'm gonna switch over to uh, like a 3.7 volt mod here with the uh, slim tank loaded up. And there is- That's a nice little slim, that's a nice slim tank you got there too, I might add. Ah, uh, thanks. Yeah, I also got this from uh, Joe Castro over at evaporclouds.com, by the way. Um, the link will be in the description. So you guys can check out. Uh, oh, he also has a show on uh, Total Vaping Network now. He does Tuesday night, eight to ten p.m. Eastern. So does that mean we can't give him bad reviews? No. <laughs> no, it doesn't mean we can't give him bad reviews. We are honest always. All right. So, anyways, but on this point, we do agree. the uh, The juice is a good flavor. Right. Uh, all day vapor? Uh, for me it is, yes. I agree. It's an all day vapor. Um, it so has been for uh, it has been for a while. This is probably my seventieth mil of this stuff. And this is a brand new bottle, just got it today, filled the card up and that's it. But uh yeah, for me it is an all day vape, yes. Right. And I've only had mine three days and you can see it is drastically leaving. Um but I do want to bring up, did you see how clear that Nick Liquid uh, really is, that e-juice? It now, is. Um, you won't be able to tell really in this 30 mil bottle, but if you look at, I have another one of his juices in a 10 mil bottle, and you can see, I mean, it's just crystal clear. Dude. Yeah, and here's a smaller bottle, but his Nick Liquid, you can see, even though there's color, you can see how clear that is. And I think that's really cool because I noticed that as soon as I unpacked it, compared to my other 10 mils from other companies. Right. Um, not that they were cloudy, but you just couldn't see right through them like that, you know? Yeah. So yeah, it's, it's, it's definitely definitely clear, no doubt. All right, so uh, we on the taste uh, scale, what, what would your taste scale be on that? For me, like I said, it is definitely one of my all-day vapes. Um, this and another juice right now definitely... All day vapes. Um, I'm gonna go if we're going on a scale one to ten. I'm gonna give this a solid, solid ten. Okay. Well, that's good. I'm that taking we... it all the way to the top of this one, baby. All right. I will give it an eight point five. How do you like that one? Eight point five, good. It is a good flavor. I like it. Um, it's very reminiscent of blueberries that I've had before. It is a candy style blueberry. For me, I'm getting that's what I, flavor I'm getting. I know there's supposed to be some raspberry in there. Not raspberry, strawberry. Strawberries. I'm sorry. But, uh, yeah, see, where you get more of the blueberry, I personally get more of the strawberry out of it. Uh, the best way I can describe it and what it tastes like to me is a lifesaver strawberry cream, a little mint thing. It's almost identical to that, in my opinion. Now, Jeff gets more of the blueberry out of it. Uh, taste is very subjective. We all know that. But uh, I definitely get more of the strawberry out through. You can taste the blueberry. See, I, I get... For me, it's the strawberry. I get a primary blueberry, but the yeah, taste is subjective. If you notice, I was on the um, sidekick from Motor City Mods at 3.7. Now I'm back at 5. Just showing you the vapor production, people. Right. Uh, vapor production is awesome. I am on a Pro Verity set at 5.2, I think. Right now on a 3-ohm Boat Cardo. And uh, yeah, throat hit vapor, all off the chart, 
extremely good. Uh, not too much throat hit because I'm the kind of person that more flavor and taste and vapor production than throat hit, but it's definitely there. And uh, yeah, I mean it's 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 just, just a solid juice all the way around. Yeah, some people go crazy over throat hit. I'm not big on throat hit. I'll tell you, I just want to know I'm vaping something. Uh, if if it's uh, hits you that hard, <coughs> excuse me. Um, yeah, it's probably not for me. But right. th this is uh, this is smooth. But I can I can definitely feel that I'm vaping, and so I'm good. Now throat yeah. hit um, on a scale, I would say it's probably like a maybe a six out of ten throat hit. But really, that's where I like it. Right, so, I would give it a seven, but again, it's not. It's there, but it's not overpowering at all, and that is the way I like it too. I know some people really like a lot of throat hit. I'm not big on it. Uh, if you do like throat hit, you won't be disappointed because it is definitely there. It's just not as strong as some of the throat hits. Then again, I'm at 16 milligrams, and I do believe that nicotine plays a big, you know, part in throat hit. So. You maybe not get as much out of 16 as you would out of, let's say, a 24, but uh, for me, it's it's a perfect amount and perfect level. So yeah, and it is perfect, even though I only gave it a six. It's six out of ten being strong, medium, you know what I mean, and low throat hit. I would say it's right in the middle, right where I want it, and that's why I give it about a six for throat hit. Um, yeah, I guess uh, so. EvaporClouds.com, and this is Papa Smurf. I've got some other Smurf. flavors. Pardon me? I said Papa Smurf. Papa Smurf, everybody. Papa Smurf. <laughs> All right, everybody, vape on and vape hard. I will be. Case, anything to yep. say? See everyone later. Thanks for doing this uh, dual review, dude. That was awesome. Yep, check out the bloopers, people. <laughs> there was a lot of them. All right. Hey everybody, welcome. My name's Jeff, aka Slinger, and of course I've got my good friend here, Case1320. Hey, what's up everyone? So we're going to be hitting a double juice review like we did last time. Uh, today, what's on the table, Case? Today, we will... Oh, fuck. <laughs> today, Case is going to learn how to talk. Hey everybody, be Jeff, a.k.a. Slinger, and of course, I'm here with my good friend, Case1320. How you doing, Case? Hey, what's up, everyone? Mm. I'm hitting a vape real quick. Today, we're going to be reviewing um, a double, well, we're going to do a double juice review, blah, blah, blah. And uh, we're going to try and get it in five takes. <laughs> I don't know why it takes me 30 fucking takes to do it. <laughs> hey, everybody, catch the bloopers.